Hi, I'm Liz and I work for Thames Water and here we are in the home lab and we're going to have a look today about things that should and should not be flushed down the toilet. So here I have a couple of cotton buds which I'm going to pop into my bottle, my toilet. I'm going to give them a shake or a flush and we'll see what happens to them. As you can see, not very much. Cotton buds are made of plastic which means they won't break down so please don't flush them, pop them in the bin. Next we're going to try tissue paper. Give it a flush and spin in one piece. Right, okay, now we will try some kitchen towel. And we'll give it a shake and nothing. It stays as a kitchen towel. Let's try toilet paper now. Give it a bit of a flush. Has it disintegrated? I think it has. I'm going to try a wet wipe in my pretend toilet. We get a huge number of wet wipes flushed down into the sewer network every day. So let's see what happens to them when we do flush them. Give it a good hard shake. That the wet wipe is completely intact, hasn't broken down at all. It's in one complete piece. It's not surprising really when you realise what they're made of. Uh, they're made of the same plastic, PET, or most are anyway, made of the same plastic that this bottle is. There's only three things that you can flush down the toilet, and it's easy to remember, just think of the three P's. Poo, pee, and toilet paper. Everything else should go in the bin. Post your efforts on our social media channels. Um, and we'll see how you guys get on. All right, take care, bye-bye.